Have you ever bought an SD card to use with something, and then the SD card is too big so it just doesn't work? Well, I've got a solution. But first of all, I'm just going to show you here. I've got a 128 gigabyte SD card. This is whatever it was shipped with by default. It's XFAT. If you check there in the properties, I've got all the files in here that my device needs to run uh, with this SD card. So let me just eject it real quick. Uh, I'm Just for an example, I'm going to be testing this with a Nintendo DS flash card. So I'm just going to bring this up here real quick. So I'm going to boot up my DS. You'll see it shortly. Here it is. Then I launch the game. And all we get is a black screen because it is not reading the SD card properly. So, let me just show you how you can use bigger SD cards with devices that do not inherently support them. This would be like cameras, uh, DS flash cards, 3DS consoles, whatever. So first, you will insert the SD card into your computer. You see it here. Uh, go to Format. And now change the file system to NTFS. Allocation unit size can be whatever, it doesn't really matter. And then the format finishes, you can close it. And now you're going to want to go and download uh, this program called GUI Format. Uh, basically it's just a FAT32 format but with a user interface. This will allow you to set uh, bigger uh, types of drives to FAT32, which is more widely supported and in this case is what we are going to be using. So as you can see here, drive F, uh, that's my SD card formatted in NTFS. We're going to set the allocation unit size to 32 kilobytes, or 32768. Volume label, I'll just call it like R4, whatever. Doesn't really matter. So we're going to format it. It'll take just a little while. And now we can close it. If you check the drive's properties, you'll see that it is in fact FAT32 now. So I'm going to go ahead and put my files on it again which shouldn't take very long. I've just got a couple uh, small things here to transfer over. All right, I got primary files and I've got a game to try. So now I will eject the SD card. And now I'm going to uh, plug the SD card back into the flash cart. And then I'm going to put that flash cart in the DS. We're gonna boot it up again and give it a shot. Just a second. And this time when we start it, it loads perfect. There we go, we've got a 128 gigabyte SD card being used in a device that is supposed to support up to a maximum of 32 gigabytes due to just the way the FAT32 works. So yeah, as long as you have a bigger SD card, you can use tools like GUI format to force them into FAT32 and then they should work on these older devices. So, yeah, I hope that was helpful. You can find a link to GUI format in the description. Feel free to give it a shot. Thanks.